Yo, what's up guys? It's me, Hedgehog Coasters, and yes, it is me. And in today's video, I will be going to Six Flags New England. Yay! Except it's 10 o'clock at night. I'm not even at the park, and I'm in Springfield, which is close to the park, but not really. So currently, I'm at the Mass Mutual Center, which is in Springfield for my sister's dance competition. And it's running pretty late. I mean, it was supposed to end around now, but there's like a half an hour delay. That's great. But anyways, tomorrow I will be at the park. I'm going to discuss why Wicked Cycle is better than Superman. I'm going to go for Senator Kovis procedures. And we're going to just have a lot of fun. Now, without further ado, I will see you all in the morning. Good morning, guys. It's me, Headshot Coasters, back. And we're about to go over the bridge and possibly see Six Flags New England. Now, we're about to pull in the park in a few minutes, but I just want to see if we'll be able to spot the park from the bridge. And, uh... We're about to see, yep, so there's the skyscraper way out in the distance, and, uh, yep, you can see the drop tower a little bit, yeah, you, and you can see the lift hill of Superman to the, uh, left of the photo, and you, I even see Riddler in the back, so, we'll be in the park in a few in a few minutes, so I'll see you guys there. And we're about to pull in the park, there's the billboard, and there's the Sky Screamer. I know, it's very exciting. We did not arrive at our destination because we aren't here yet, but uh, there's Sky Screamer way up there. And we're about to go by Wicked Cyclone, and yep, there it is. There's Flashback. It's not a good ride, but the Wicked Cyclone's great. And then uh, you got Espiano Goliath. Um, that's great. You got Tomahawk coming up right there, and the drop tower. And we're finally here. So I will see you guys in the park. And here is the entrance. Yeah, that's my mom and guest relations right there, but uh, pretty happy right now. Um, we finally made it. I don't know if they're still doing Dinosaurs Alive. Or, not, not Dinosaurs Alive, Dinosaur. A walker experience. It's Dinosaurs Alive. I mean, I don't know. It was kind of successful, but whatever. And there's Thunderbolt in the back. I don't really like it, but I'm probably gonna have to ride it today. There's also the support trick live in the background, but that's SBNL finally. And of course, there's the New England Sky Screamer. There's Scream, the drop tower with all the flags in the back. And there's the closed water park right now, but that's okay. We're about to step inside the park in a few minutes, and we're probably gonna ride probably Pandemonium first because that gets some of the longer lines, but uh, I'll see. It's after a long struggle, we are finally in the park, and they are still doing dinosaurs a walk through experience. This is Dino Might, I believe. It looks uh, like a dinosaur. We got the Grand Carousel there. I think that's what it's called. Yep, Grand Carousel. Do not ride it, but it's fun. When dinosaurs roar the earth. All right. Yeah, the park opened in like 1898. Or not, maybe not then. 1888, I don't know, way back when. Uh, you got some banners. There's Goliath in the back and the Sky Screamer Scream. And you got the Lift Hill of Superman, which we saw earlier. They got a nice new sign for Six Flags over there. Oh, okay. Uh, there's a long line for flash pass. I feel like I have to wait in that. But uh, we also got a few things happening up here. Here's I have to get a fast pass. But uh, this is a cute little minute. I miss it when they have pavers instead of the uh, pavement. It's not great for the hot body. You got really hot, but it's nice. So yeah. Oh, they also had a DC Superstore. I think they renamed it, so that's kind of cool. All right. So we have to do this now. Get a fast pass. I'm right, finally in the park. So here's Goliath, supposedly going to Great Adventure. That would be good for the park, not for uh, Great Adventure. But uh, there's Flashback. Hey, you guys want to play with the Sky Screamer? They're all doing the dinosaurs today. That's kind of funny. Mama. That's fun. Uh, they got the hot air balloons running. Kitty area is mostly open, I think. I mean, it's open. So, I've heard about the sanitation here, or, like, operations right now being a little slow. Sure. So, I think for our first ride of the year, actually, we're going to do balloon race because, uh, there's no, there's not really a line, and, uh, we don't really have anything better to do right now. I mean, obviously, pandemonia, but, uh, this seems like we could just get on it right away. I think they're just running it just to clean it, so, uh. Here's a Stegosaurus, I think that's what they're. Hopefully, I don't know. But yeah, so we're gonna do this, and I will give you my reaction afterwards. Balloon race. So I kind of forgot to record, but we just got off Pandemonium. Uh, 
So we did the hot air balloons, that was fun. Pandemonium was actually running pretty good today. There's a nice little airtime hill after the uh, bird mid-course break run, and it gives you some nice little floater. Nothing insane, but it's a great family coaster, but it's pretty aggressive. So we're going to the Scrambler next. So uh, while we walk there, there's um, Skyscraper again. There's the Crown Jewel the Park, Wicked Cyclone, which is better than Superman. The airtime is better, it's smoother. Um, you know, as three great inversions, you know, I really like it. I think just the first four, like, elements alone on Outright are great. So there's the Scrambler. We're gonna do that. Then probably Wicked Cyclone and the Skyscreamer. Blizzard River was open today, which was kind of a surprise for me. Um, I didn't think it'd be open, but it is pretty nice out. So we may do that, but probably not. So here's the Scrambler. We're gonna do that, and, uh, We'll see where we end up next. Probably we can cycle now. What's good? We got some pandemonium running. Um, so actually, we did a few rides. So we did the Scrambler, which was a lot of fun. Um, the one at Grayscape was a runs a lot faster, and it's indoors, so it's better. But it's okay. Then we did the World Famous Wicked Cycle in the back there. Greatest ride in the park by far. I mean, my favorite element is the double down. I feel like both parts of it do give a good amount of air time. Um, there's pandemonium again. Then we did the Skyscraper. So, I, I don't know if you guys can see, but the swings are kind of out of shape right now. I, so, it's kind of pretty windy up there, and um, and I mean windy as in I was pretty scared. And I'm not really scared of heights, but it was really windy. They were swings, as in the people in front of me, their swings literally rotated 180 degrees, and they were fake. And I'm not kidding. Like, you can look up there right now and see that. But anyways, right now we are at top six. Maybe I can get the sign. Yeah, top six. The generic... Uh, and Express, so uh, yeah, we're gonna get some that. I'm getting some uh, peak and broccoli. Looks pretty good. Here I am right now. This is the airtime hill right there where the train just went over. When you're going down it, you actually get some nice little pop of floater, which is pretty nice considering that these are really bulky lap bars. Now this is a fun ride too, but it is pretty intense. You do get a lot of, uh, it spins around a lot. And uh, especially when you're going down this like helix and then like down and up again right there, it's really scary. But uh, it's going well. I mean, they do, they're do sanitizing the rides every cycle, which is kind of annoying actually, because instead of doing sanitizing, while they're sanitizing one free, rows one, three, and five, they just don't let anyone else on the train. So they should do one, three, five, and then two, four, six, so like every other row. So like for ride, no, they don't do that. So they do one, three, five, they, they sanitize it, they run around once, and then they do one, three, five again. So they don't do like every other run, which is really annoying. I mean, this fast just at this park are kind of slow already, and this really just isn't helping them out. But uh, no, the Scrambler was a walk-on. Um, Skyscreamer was having issues, so we basically got it. We only have to wait in line for five minutes. This we had a fast pass for. Uh, so we're getting chopsticks right now. Then we're probably going to do a Scream, Thunderbolt, which you can't really see right now. And then head towards the back of the park to Superman. Um, Gotham City Gauntlet, probably be Batman, a few other rides. And I mean, I guess we'll see where we end up after this. So, I'm gonna go eat, I'm gonna give you a little review on my food, and then I will see you guys before the next ride. Alright, so I'm actually, uh, I kind of forgot to record, so currently I'm by Joker. Today I'm not doing Joker because I don't feel like it. Um, I'm also near Harley, we're also right next to Harley Quinn, my mom and sister are riding that. I don't like Harley Quinn either. Um, I kind of get, these are really the only rides I get scared on. The, um, the Zamperla Giant um, Pendulums uh, Discoveries, yeah. Giga Discovery, Giant Discovery. I get freaked out by these, and I'm sorry. It, it's just scary, and I really don't like them. But anyway, so I kind of forgot to record. So we did the bumper cars, that was a lot of fun. Um, there was some kid that uh, was having some difficulty, so I kind of felt bad for him. Of course, I just bumped into him a lot. Here's my buddy here. I think this is the actual Stegosaurus. I was wrong earlier. It is not a Stegosaurus. They got these nice little sides. It's a Brachiosaurus, which is kind of cool. Um, but yeah, so there's Batman in the background, so we're probably gonna do that next. But anyway, so after the bumper cars, we did Scream, which was basically a walk-on. Uh, we got right on it. It was a great ride. I had a lot of fun. I um, We did the launch, it was fun. And then we did Superman. Dude, Superman was great. Um, all right, pretty rough, and that's why Wicked Cycle was better. It's not rough, but it had a, definitely had a little bit more of a rattle this time. It's definitely not the greatest, and the restraints suck. 
I mean, you know us guys here. I mean, it, it's really bad for your vibes. It's not great. And plus, you get really, and plus, your ride outs do staple you, and then the lap part just comes down, comes down more and more on the ride. So that's not great. But anyway, so we're gonna do, and then we also did um, Gotham City Gauntlet, which you can't really see. But um, that was not great. I mean, it was fine. We waited in line for like 40 minutes, which was not worth it. And, uh, you know, it was fine. It's better than most of the other wild mice out there. Uh, but yeah, it really wasn't great. And then, um, yeah, so now we're at Harley Quinn. Um, we ended up not doing Thunderbolt today because it is pretty rough and I don't really care for it too much. It doesn't really give any airtime. I've already been on it enough times. Maybe I'll go on it on my next visit. Maybe I'll even go on it later today. I don't know. But yeah, so my mom and sister are on Batman, or Harley Quinn right now. And after that, we're gonna do Batman and then uh, Gotham City Crime Wave. And then, I don't know, probably not Riddler today. Not like, a, that's another ride, I'm not really feeling like a ride, but uh, you know, definitely I will do it. Also, they've definitely gotten better. Like they added this nice, they've added a lot of statues. I forgot to show in the Gotham City, or, or the DC area, but they added a lot more statues. They have one of the Catwoman. This one's uh, Harley Quinn. I think they added one of the Flash. I haven't seen any Batman uh, statues yet. That's pretty good. And just the park in general is pretty well themed. I mean, like you got the cool little dinosaur thing going on right now, which is nice. But like just in general, like you got a cute little midwife. The only issue is all the blacktop. I mean, they really need to fix this. They don't, luckily they don't have it in the water park, but they really need to get some new, like, you gotta do more stone. Even, if, I know it costs more, but park improvements, you know, even if they just do that for 2022, I would really like it if they did that. But, uh, it's going well. Um, the other annoying thing is the Joker line starts back there. Like, Joker's right here, but the line starts all the way back there, which is kind of, so that's why a lot of people kind of miss it. But no, it's a really cute little park. So, what's gonna happen is, my mom and sister are gonna ride this, then we're gonna head over to Batman, do crime wave back there. And then, I don't know, we'll probably head back to uh, the DC area to do Catwoman's Whip. Maybe we'll do Thunderbolt, and uh, I also want to do Wild Wheels, but I don't know why. But basically, Wild Wheels is this cute little like, car ride they got here at the uh, park, and it's uh, kind of like a jungle ride, and it's kind of cool. I kind of actually like it a lot. So yeah, we might do that. But uh, So yeah, I will see you all in a little bit after I do Batman and Crime Wave, and yeah. So um, I actually did this. I didn't, I've never been on it, and I've kind of said, when I decided I didn't really feel like it, I meant I didn't, I was kind of scared, but I did it. Um, so it's actually not that rough, but it's kind of fun. So um, probably the best SLC out there. So uh, you know what? This is one of the actually big pluses for Six Flags doing it. So uh, good job getting yourself an actual good SLC. I hate the paint colors. If it, I wish it was light green and purple, but yeah, that's just me. But you know what? Great job. Yeah, so now we're gonna do Batman, then the swings yonder there. I don't know. And I think that's pretty much gonna do it for the vlog. I'm probably just gonna do a few re-rides on Superman stuff, but uh, I'll see you after I do those few rides. And uh, just for reference, the park is kind of busy. Um, and uh, I did actually go to another bathroom. Much nicer than the one I was at earlier, so maybe, they are, maybe that was just the one restroom, I don't know. But uh, there's Harley Quinn going. So yeah, I will see you all right after Batman. All right, so I did Batman and the swing ride. So they aren't really visible, but imagine they're just over the building. So um, Batman, first of all, is kind of rough. All right, I'm not gonna lie. But if you keep your head out for it, which isn't impossible, you'll be fine. I did it today. I didn't really even have a headache that much, which is great. Then did the swing ride, Gotham City Crime Week. It's a fun ride. It's great for kids and families. Now. Also, it has pretty good capacity, and it does get a good cycle. So yeah, so currently we're in like the Kidsopolis area, but we're actually ordering food. So we got food from Matcha Matcha. My sister got a slice of pizza. So uh, probably after this, we're probably just gonna do a few more rides on Superman. Um, I kinda wanna do Catwoman's Whip, and I kinda wanna do Wild Wheels, or I don't know why. But we're definitely gonna do Superman. So yeah, we're just gonna eat our dinner, probably get our snack, and uh, there you got a uh, fireball. Guess what? It's the New England skyscraper. First time we've seen it today. I know, right? And of course, the SBNL Glide. So that's good. And with that note, I will see you 
at the next ride that I see you at. All right, here's the icon of the park. Wicked Cyclone's still better. Uh, Catwoman's Whip had a super long line, so we are not doing that today. But that's all right. I mean, it's only a family coaster. It's good, but it's just a family coaster. So, uh, but it's fun. So we're gonna get on Superman. And that's probably gonna do it here for our day at uh, Six Flags New England, but uh, I don't know. I'll probably guys see you guys at the end of the, at the end of the day here. So we're about to go on Superman. Let's go! Woo! All right, so this is pretty much going to do it for my day here at Six Flags New England. We got back on Superman, it was fun. Catwoman's Whip had a long line, so we didn't do it, but that's okay. I got my mid ice through from Six Below. Um, we're about to leave for today. I had a great time. I probably will be back here probably in the month for uh, some more rides with Wicked Cyclone Superman. I hope you enjoyed the vlog, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye.